Wagner Group may soon cease to exist. Yevgeny Prigozhin, the owner of the private military company Wagner, has stated that the Wagnerites are running out and the company may soon cease to exist. We are approaching the point where the Wagner private military company is ending and in a short time, Wagner will cease to exist, he said. Told that statements like this would be demoralizing for Russians, the Wagner leader answered that he would say it again. Prigozhin claimed that the Wagnerites would go down in history. He also alluded, not for the first time, to the lack of ammunition. Prigozhin said this week his troops were suffering heavy casualties due to a lack of support from Moscow. Wagner has in the past dispatched soldiers to fight in Syria and in conflicts across Africa. The Russian paramilitary organization is accused of human rights abuses, war crimes, unlawful killings, and gold smuggling. It allegedly has close links to the Russian state and Vladimir Putin. Prigozhin criticizes the Russian Ministry of Defense and Russian officials. This only serves to underline the conflict between the mercenaries and the regular army of the Russian Federation. In particular, he constantly complains about the lack of ammunition, believing that the Russian generals are trying to kill more convicts and Wagner mercenaries. Separate Russian sources are saying that Prigozhin wants to gain the approval of and even greater support from the Kremlin. Andriy Yusov, a representative of Defense Intelligence of Ukraine's Ministry of Defense, believes that Prigozhin's remarks reflect the mood of Russia's political and military elite. And now there are many tiny cracks in the Kremlin that will only get wider.